crazy and wild Ho Chi Minh City or Saigon. Today, I'm gonna take you around on my first impressions of Vietnam. I've already done a video showing you my first day, but I've got some goals and some things that I'd like to do for this video. All right, so first up, I have not had any coffee or food yet, and it's approaching 12 o'clock. So, I think there is an egg coffee spot up here called Little Hanoi. So I think I'm gonna go get some egg coffee. I have been in Vietnam for a few days now, and I'm quickly falling in love with this place. Uh, I think I want to spend a pretty significant amount of time here in Saigon or Ho Chi Minh because I've only been in District 1, but there are so many other districts to explore. And this feels like a very touristy district, so I want to get more into the local side of things. I also want to have my first bowl of pho today. I've been waiting out. I've been eating banh mi's in rice dishes because I wanted to take you on my experience having my first bowl of pho here in Vietnam. So yeah, as I've stated in another video, uh, Ho Chi Minh City or Saigon has population of over 9 million. I believe it's approaching uh, 9.5 million. The population's on the rise, it's not on the decline. And you can really feel that here. I love the energy here. I think Little Hanoi is down this road here. Seems to be quite a popular spot. Okay. Excuse me. Sorry, I just had to do it. Sorry. It's okay. I'll just have egg coffee. Okay. Thank you. Okay, they even show you how to eat or how to drink egg coffee. Can you see this? Taste, taste a little sweet cream on top of the cup first, then slowly enjoy the lower part of the coffee. After that, you can freely mix two layers and enjoy the exciting sense of sweetness, fatness, and bitterness. Ooh. Yes. Thank you. So we've got this water here, but okay. So this is like a it's like a yellow tint to it, and I've noticed other places where I've got coffee. I haven't tried it yet. It's not water; it's something else. It's really good. Have to ask them. Can I ask you, uh, what drink is this? Yeah, it's just a cinnamon tea. Cinnamon tea. Yes. Okay, yeah. I was trying to forget. Thank you very much. Okay, so I don't know if that'll be edited in the video or not, but it's a cinnamon tea. I love it. Okay, so first we're gonna take. Here's the egg coffee. So if you don't know, it's egg yolk, sugar and black coffee. So we're gonna taste a little bit, we're gonna follow the directions here. We're gonna taste a little of the sweet cream on top. But let me show you first. Look at this, look at how creamy that is. Oh my God. Oh, I am so excited. Here's like a dessert. Oh. And slowly enjoy the lower part of the coffee. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. What happens if I try 
try to drink from them. Nope. Okay. So now we're gonna mix it all together. Just look at this. Oh man. Mm. Mm. So good. I'm gonna enjoy this. Okay, well that lived up to the hype. My god, I'm probably gonna have so many egg coffees here. So it's interesting, the uh some of you, my new Vietnamese viewers are like, duh, but their sidewalks here have like a ramp to them so you'll see many people just like take their scooters because scooters are so prevalent here i've never seen so many scooters in my life people just ramp onto the they'll just ramp onto the sidewalk and kind of like this and kind of subvert traffic it's it's interesting i've never seen it anywhere but there's this uh place called enter the void here so enter the void I almost got hit. Enter the Void is a really good movie that I'd recommend you watch. I don't know if it took place in Ho Chi Minh or not. I think it was Tokyo, actually, is where the movie was based around. But now I'm on a quest to get my first bowl of pho here in Vietnam. So yeah, when you think of Asian, specifically South Asian megacities, uh, Ho Chi Minh is one that definitely comes to mind. It's one of the larger cities here in Southeast Asia. And you can tell that there's a lot of development going on here. Uh, it's very modern. And I've seen other influence, influence from other si bigger cities. Like there's a Japanese town, a Korean town. A lot of, there's a huge, uh, particularly a very huge Korean influence, which I know is not Southeast Asia, but uh, yeah, there's like a big influence here. Also guys, look at this. Matcha frappe, frappe. I'm sure Vietnamese McDonald's has the best McDonald's coffee of any McDonald's in the world. Because the coffee here, coffee's insane. I love it. I drink a lot of coffee, so I'm definitely in coffee heaven here. Okay, well, I'm really interested in trying this one bus spot, and I think we're just gonna have to risk it here. There's no sidewalk, but we're going. By the way, if you've been to uh, Southeast Asia before, oh, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Uh, if you've been to Southeast Asia before, you probably shouldn't have an issue with the road uh, safety, crossing the road. It is a little bit, the difficulty is probably 100 out of 100. You're definitely playing on expert mo mode when crossing the road here, but if you've been to like Bangkok or other places, you should be fine. So there is a special Pho place. If I'm saying pho, I'm sorry. It's, I know it's pho. It's called pho 2000. And this is a place that former president of the United States, Bill Clinton, visited. I think it's around here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Pho 2000. You can see it says Hello. See fa. Fa for the president. Yeah. What's the best fa? I don't know. I think beef tenderloin. Yeah, probably what I'm gonna go with. Come on, thank you. It's interesting because. Although former President Bill Clinton visited this place, it actually only has like a 3.9 or 3.8, which suggests to me that there's probably better pho in uh, Hanoi, or sorry, in Saigon, my apologies. And so we'll have to also explore some other pho places during my time here. But I imagine that this is gonna be really good. I've only had pho in the US. You can see the uh, various presidents here. Bill Clinton, there's Bill Clinton some other presidents as well. Ah, George Bush was here. The first, the first one, HW. Interesting. Someone told me, I don't know, I wasn't able to confirm this, but someone told me Obama visited this as well. I'd imagine they'd have Obama's picture on the wall, so I don't know if he did or not, but. Hey guys, so here it is. Ooh. Boy, does that look good. Got some spring rolls and got a really well-balanced meal here. 
The food is so healthy. Put some of these chilies in here. And by some, I mean all. Bit of veg. I'm interested in trying this beef tenderloin first. I don't care what the review says. It doesn't matter if it's a 3.8. This bowl of uh, is really good. Beef is like spiced really well, flavored really well. Try the broth. Mm. Of course, broth is flavorful. Some of these noodles. Oh yeah, I'm happy with that. Okay, well, that meal, as I've already stated, was incredible. That is a 3.8. I can't wait to see what else is here. But uh, it appears to be raining a bit, so I think I know the exact place to go. And that is the Bantan Market here, which is one of the must-do attractions in Saigon. It's a place where you can buy fake goods and negotiate. Okay, we gotta just figure out a way to go here. Okay, so on the outer edge here, you have uh, some goods, but I want to get inside here. I don't really have anything that I need, because uh, I just, I travel with two backpacks, so I don't really pick much up, but I'm interested. Maybe we will find something. Ah, oh, this is interesting. Ah, oh, these are cool. So this is like an indoor market, unlike the Chattuchak market, which is in Bangkok. This is indoor, but it's a similar vibe. It's not as big, but it's open 24-7. Or sorry, it's open, I believe, not 24-7, but I believe seven days a week. Ah, oh, this looks cool. Hello. Ah, uh, no, 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 thank you. Hello. Xin chào. Xin chào. Plates or decoration? Yes, decoration. Decoration. Yes, you can do this. I just can explain in this one. Uh -huh. Mm. This looks cool, guys. Oh, uh, but you can also hang it up. Yes, you can this the hand. Right? Uh, ah, yes, yes, yes. How much? Yeah, this one, uh, 250. Oh, 250. This one is more one 150. Oh. Yes. 50. Oh. Come on. Oh, Come on. What's the lowest price? Okay, 150. 100. Well, one. Yeah. 100. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, I come back. 120, okay? Okay, 100. Okay. You sell for me? 100? Okay. Okay, come on. Thank you. Thank you. Nice. I like that. Either give it away or keep it. Oh, it really goes on quite a ways here. By the way, 100 dong is uh, $4.25, roughly. So, did I overpay? Maybe. Hi. Hello. Can I help you? Uh, maybe. <laughs> What's, maybe, how much? Money. Money? Oh, mag magnet. Magnet. Uh, I already have a magnet. How much is uh, how much are these? Uh, you buy one or one set. Uh, let's see. I have a spoon. A spoon. Yep. Mm. You want one or one set? No. 
Hmm, how much? Yeah. Oh. For a bag. Okay, for one piece like this, I make for you, okay, good deal Say Vietnam dough. And how many do you want? No rock then. 45 for one? Yeah, double. Oh, too high. Minutes. Too high. <laughs> how many you need? Uh, come back. Okay, thank you. This would be a great gift. This would be a great gift. Oh, thank you. Fresh Jackfruit? Yeah. Oh, mango. Mango. Sugar or no sugar? Huh? Sugar. It has sugar on it? Yes, oh. sugar. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Sorry, thank you. Are you going this? Uh, no, 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 thank you. Uh, I, I, have, uh, I have more without sugar. You want to see? Yeah. I'll show you. Okay. 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 Okay, let's see. Let's see. This one. You want the small side or the big side? So, small. This side. Are you sure? No, I see sugar. Are you sure? No, this one without sugar. No, Not with the sugar. no, 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 no. Really? Sure. Look. You can see different the color, right? No. With the sugar, and this one without sugar. Here? No, 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 no. They have, they both have sugar. Yes. No, no. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, come on. Okay. I'm not the world's best bargainer, I'll be honest with you. And that's a little chaotic for me. Okay guys, it is later in the day and I'm gonna take a motorbike to the Winway walking street. So let's go. Hi there, uh, Winway? Yep. Winway, okay. Yes, yes. Okay.
soju infused lager. Wow. Let's give it a shot. Wow, it's good. It's called Cheeky Plum. I'm glad I came here now. Alright, well, I think cheers, by the way. I think this walking street looked a little different in some of the videos I've seen online, but I think it's because of this soccer tournament or soccer match. Look at this. Could I have picked a better day to do this video? Oh no, this is it. This is definitely it. Wait, do you get free Red Bull too? Are you serious? No. Guys, I have said this about a million times in my first two Vietnam videos, this being the second one. I am so happy to be here. This feels so good. So maybe this is uh, put on by the Ho Chi Minh City Football Club. Pretty awesome. Ah, looks like we got some memorabilia over here too. I've seen people with like multiple beers. I'm sure I could just go get another one. Should we guys? I was gonna sit down and have a beer, but if they're free, I mean my God. What, uh, what flavors do you have? Uh, one is cherry plum, and another is uh, wonder melon. I'll go with the melon. Yes. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Free. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Is this a special event? Is this a special uh, this event? Is our new product, so we give for our customer first try. You know? Okay. It's free. It's very good. Yeah. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. They're both good. Better be careful. So yeah guys, I mean, first impression of Vietnam, what do I say? Couldn't be happier, couldn't be more excited. You know, uh, when I set out to, by the way, if you don't know, if you're new here, or you just didn't see my other videos, I'll be in Southeast Asia for pretty much all of 2023. And when I set out to come to uh, Southeast Asia, Vietnam was a, a big one on my list. I just didn't do a lot of research. And I can tell you, this has exceeded my expectations. <laughs> so nice here, you should absolutely come. I plan on coming back already. I'm already planning on coming back this year during this trip. Over here's the uh, Ho Chi Minh City Football Club. So, really convenient location near this awesome walking street. Wow. Wow, guys. Very excited to explore other districts in Ho Chi Minh City. Honestly, I was planning on going to Da Nang, Hoi An, Hanoi, like in a week. I might just come back and do those later and explore Saigon for three weeks because oh, I feel at home here. do it I'd probably choose this area uh, to stay other than where I'm staying in district 1 I don't know if this is still considered district 1 or a different district but the vibe is cleaner it's not as chaotic it's not as much of a party uh, which I'm not a crazy partier but uh, nonetheless life lessons
Now I know. Uh, what's up, man? Uh, where are you from? America. United States. Where are you from? America. United States. America. Yeah, Vietnam. Yeah. I'm from Vietnam, go to uh, New York, America. Oh, nice. Yeah. Nice, nice. yeah. Awesome. Do you like to skateboard? Yeah. Yeah, nice. So, you want to just spot? Skateboard? Oh, yeah. I'll try. Okay, I'll try. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Is that yours? Yeah, yeah. Okay. You want camera, selfie? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I haven't done this in a while. Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Good job. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Can you kick flip? Can you kick flip? Yeah. Ooh. Almost. All right, you go. Yeah. Okay, you go. Yeah. No, no. No? Oh. No, cuz. No, ah, okay. Yeah. Ooh. Have a good night, bro. Yeah. Yes. See ya. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. I've not skateboarded in uh, since I was a teenager. So, if I add that to the video, I'm sorry. This guy's, this is sick. This is really sick. Oh, win way. This is a vibe. This is a vibe, guys. Saigon Sky Deck. Let's try this. I'm sure it's sick. Hello. Uh, sky deck, is it uh, like, does it overlook? Ah, uh, yeah, but you will go up to 49th floor of the building in a white hair. You will stay inside, go around, enjoy the whole view of the city. Okay. Looks like you get a coat in there as well. Hi there. Let me see the ticket. Alright, we're getting our photo done, okay. It's gonna cost ten dollars to get in here, but might as well do it. Wow, guys! Ooh. You're afraid of heights. This is a it's a rough one, but look at that view of Saigon. Oh my goodness! Presume it goes all the way around here. Take a look at this. Oh, wow. Gives you the uh, points of interest here. So you can photos on Is this the photo that was taken downstairs? Oh, there I am. Yeah, for our backgrounds. For what? For backgrounds. Oh. You want to keep it like a souvenir? There I am. Oh man, how much is it? Oh, uh, 140 for one picture. Uh, I can send you an email if you want. Okay. Mm. Um, 140 for three pictures, send your email. Oh, okay. You can choose the picture you want. We have four here. Uh, what is that? About, uh, oh my gosh, the math, probably like six dollars. <laughs> uh, something like that. I'm good. Okay, well, I think that just about wraps up my amazing, incredible, crazy first impressions of Ho Chi Minh City, Vietnam. Thank you so much for being here. If you have not already subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button for more content. And I'm going to certainly be talking to you again soon. Peace.